Hello everyone, I'm Matt Watson. Some people ask me, you know, why do you play the CX-12? Um, I mean, why wouldn't I play the CX-12? I mean, this is just a fabulous instrument. One of the things I like about it is it's right out of the box. Factory, it's airtight, very airtight. Um, it's because the replates are recessed inside the comb. I'll show that to you. So I like the warm tone I can produce from this. Um, I love that I can clean the slide in a snap. I mean, the biggest problem I have with the chromatic harmonica is over time the slide starts to stick. And, you know, the slide, what will you do without the slide? I mean, there's things you can do, but the slide is very important. So what's really cool is I can just push this little tab on the back of the slide and I could just take it out. And then I rinse it in tap water and just rinse it. Um, sometimes I don't even dry it off. I just shake it because it's good to get a little bit of the water that's still on the slide. And I put it back in and it cleans the inside of the uh, housing unit or the comb. And it goes right back in. Another really cool thing about this is if you can see, there's a coil spring. Can you see that? What's really great about that spring is it is never broken. It will not break. I mean, I haven't been able to get it to break. Um, on my 270 harmonica, I also had a Toots hard bopper. I also have a, um, uh, a 280 and um, a 64X. All of those harmonicas, I have broken the spring. The spring is like this, and it, it's got a little round coil at the bottom, and there's the base here, and as you move that over time, it just breaks. I've been um, on stage when it broke. In the middle of performing, I've had it break, you know. So, yeah, that's one of the really great things I like about this. Second thing I like is taking it apart I can take out the comb and by just pushing on the back of this spring plate. There's a spring plate here, a spring bar um, that pushes the um, uh, comb against the housing unit, which also helps make it very airtight. So you just push this like this with your two thumbs. That's what I'm doing. It comes right out. You can see that it's bent a little bit, apply pressure on the back, and then this just comes right out. So then this is super easy to clean. And then of course there are screws um, that hold the replate on, and you probably, I don't know how well you can see this in this video, but the, it, there's a little, it's recessed. The replates are sitting down in the comb, which is why it's so airtight. So, and then, you know, putting it back together is a snap. You just put it back in, take the spring bar, there we go. And then you take your slide, done, bye.